Hey, what's going on, guys? This is my first live video I'm doing, and this makes the fourth one I'm doing. And today I'm going to talk about the new Punisher TV show that was released on Netflix this past year. John Bernthal, that plays the main the title character, did an excellent job. Now, the others that played him in the past, Dolph Lundgren of The Expendables in 1989, Thomas Jane of 2004, and Ray Stevenson in 2008, did 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 the character did the character in their own good in their own way, but it didn't really hit well with audiences. I, I'm noticing now. My favorite, my personal favorite, was Punisher Warzone, the one that Ray Stevenson was in, because the others to me it didn't really take take it serious, take the character seriously until Punisher Warzone, but. At the same time, I do admit, it was a little bit of a weak story. Like, whenever, and I'm noticing, like, whenever Hollywood does a character like that and puts it in a movie and it fails countless of times, Netflix see, tends to have, tends to be the savior. And whatever, it just seems like whatever Netflix does, they can do no wrong. And I agree with that, too. I watch like countless of other uh, episodes, uh, TV shows. Like I just got done with Luke Cage. It was pretty good, even though I never heard of that title character before I started watching it. And Iron Fist. And what I really love the most about these TV shows is that they cross over with each other, and with the movies as well, with the um, Marvel movies, because it's all one universe. And that's what I love, and um, like when they cross it over like that, it just makes it very interesting. But I don't know if they're going to do the same thing with the Punisher because the Punisher is, to me, is like way darker than any of the others. He's a vigilante. He takes the law into his own hands. I mean, most of y'all know that, but um, he's he's unique. He doesn't have no special powers. But um, the the reason why he is the way he is, if you ever look into the character, you can kind of see why he is the way he is. And he's ex uh, or he he was military as well, so he's got good training. But um, to shorten this up, to to wrap this up, uh, check it out if you got Netflix. And I don't know when the first season will ever hit DVD. Um, just depends on the supply and demand, I guess. But um, check it out if you can. And um, for Marvel comic fans, diehard fans, I think you'll be satisfied, thoroughly pleased. And um, to wrap this video up, uh, click like and subscribe for future videos. And I'll do my best to deliver as uniquely and as, you know, the best way I can. And I um, hope y'all have a great, I hope y'all have a great rest of the weekend and week, week ahead. Y'all take care. Peace.